Okay, we have Rapid Miner open. With Rapid Miner open, we see a bunch of different dialog boxes on the outside and an empty process pane in the middle. Our only objective in this really brief tutorial is to read in an Excel file and see the results. So if we go over to the Operators menu over here and we search Excel, you'll see a Read Excel Operator. Just drag that onto the pane. Next, we need to adjust some settings over here for the Read Excel Operator. Let's just click the Import Configuration Wizard. It'll make this easy for us. You have to go find where you downloaded and saved the data set onto your own laptop or computer. I saved mine into a folder on my desktop called Tutorial. There it is. Click Next. I only have four columns here of variables. I make sure the box is checked that says define header row because my first row really does have my variable names. Click Next. I can format my columns. I actually want to make a few adjustments here. It can be a little tricky to click these little menu uh, icon settings sometimes, so don't get frustrated, just keep trying. I'm going to adjust this to binomial, meaning there's only two categories. For my number of calls, rather than calling it an integer, I'm going to adjust this so that it's a real. We'll talk about what these are a little bit more in future videos. My sales conference, I'm going to change that type also to binomial, meaning two categories. And then finally, my DV by whether there's a sale or no sale, I'm going to adjust that and change that type to binomial. can finish up. And now all the import configuration wizard did was adjust all of these other menu settings for me automatically. We could go back and then manually tweak them again, but we should be good. Now take your output of your operator and drag it over to the RES or the results. This creates a workflow, so it'll read in the Excel file and then send it over to our results. And we should be able to run it. Notice we're now in our results menu. Now we see all of our data imported into Rapid Miner, all 100 records. And if we click on the Statistics tab, we see a drop-down menu with some summary stats. With this task completed, complete the prompts for your homework assessment assignment.